Who doesn't enjoy a glass of fresh orange juice? The only way to make that better is to fresh squeeze it yourself. If you have access to fresh picked oranges like we do here on the Marsh Prepper channel, then stay tuned. We're going to show you the best way to squeeze that. Or even if you have store-bought oranges or from a neighbor or someone else, let's take a look. So what do you use to get that fresh home squeeze orange juice in the shortest amount of time and effort possible? There are YouTube videos out there that show a blender process, or do you stick with the traditional juicer? Well, personally, there is no question whatsoever. The blender is the worst option possible. Uh, if you look at the YouTube videos that show a blender and a strainer, um, you won't see where they're actually pouring the juice into the strainer. For the simple fact is the strainer clogs up in a matter of seconds and you're left with a strainer full of juice with all the pulp at the bottom. So don't even consider this. If you need a good blender at your home for other purposes, I recommend margaritas. I'll leave a link in the description for a, uh, a blender I recommend, and you can click on that easily. What I do recommend is a juicer. So let's take a look at some of the functions. So this I've had for years. It is a Black & Decker juicer. It has a uh, variable pulp adjustment here that will let you easily adjust the amount of pulp, pulp that you want in your orange juice. Um, I'm gonna leave a link in the description below for a newer model that is on Amazon that I will be getting very shortly because we go through a five gallon bucket of oranges in a week and that will make uh, about a pitcher of half of orange juice. So um, no need to talk about it anymore. Let's check out some, let's check out some video from these oranges being squeezed.